So I added a slope to the scene, but not a lot has changed. The yellow line that you see on the left is the vector that we're adding to the player. And just like before, we can interact with other physical objects in the scene. I can also go up the slope, go on to the next platform, jump off, you know, the, the normal stuff. If I look at the player controller, most of it is the same. So in the fixed update, we still have the rotation, getting the walk direction, and walking towards your target. One big difference is canceling vertical velocity. And if I look at the function where we're getting the walk direction, we use something called project on plane. If you look at one of Unity's default templates, they also use this function. So let's say you have a plane that looks like this. And if your target walk direction is going this way, by projecting this vector on a plane, you might have a new vector that looks like this with the exact same amount of magnitude, except the direction is based on the normal of the plane. So back in Unity, if I go down the slope, you see that vector changing according to the platform you're on. But you might have noticed that it doesn't change when I'm going up the slope. That is because I realized that Unity has a weird physics issue. To show you this, I'm going to go back to the code and get rid of the line where I'm manually canceling the upward force. And see what happens when I play. It seems like when I add this force, the player goes way up and forward just a little bit. I don't know why it's like that, but I have to compensate. So back in the code, the parts where I cancel velocity and go straight forward instead of diagonally up, those two parts will make sure that the player remains on the ground. So if I play again, things will be better. Another issue, you might notice this white stuff on the side. That is because I want to have zero friction there. So if I were to collide against the wall, even though I'm trying to walk through it, I'm sort of sliding. Whereas if I'm on the slope, I want a little bit of friction here so I'm not sliding down. Physics materials can make a big difference, but I'm not sure if I want to use that or write additional code for wall collisions. For those decisions, I would have to run more tests, or in the future I might even change my mind. But anyways, another major issue that you might run into is the gravity. Because Unity gravity isn't exactly like gravity, you sort of float off when you're not grounded. And you can sort of float off and come back to the platform Okay, you're not exactly falling, you're, you're sort of floating in midair. So these things I would have to play around with the settings, run more experiments, and possibly have additional code. For this video, I'm happy with the very basic stuff, the slope and the platform, and I'll add more details as I go on. Okay, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.